the concept of a program slowly matured or evolved to the concept of a box. Big Picture 8 is powered uh, by boxes with the new overview module. You can now allow users to see a cross enterprise view of all projects, products, programs. Okay, let me expand some of those items here and much more. Using drag and drop, I can easily organize them into portfolio. What you see here is a uh, is what we refer to as a box switcher. What are the three main benefits of the new concept of boxes? First of all, Big Picture now allows different management methodologies and frameworks. We can now modify the module names for each of the phases. I can apply different terminology. Besides that, uh, we can also aggregate uh, data. They Data aggregation is now possible in the overview uh, module. For example, a status-based report or time-tracking progress report. A status aggregation includes not only my JIRA data, but I'm actually also connected to, uh, to, a tr to, to Trello. Soon you will be able to uh, connect to other tools such as Microsoft Azure or other JIRA instances and have all your information in one place, while your teams can still be using the tools of their choice boxes uh, within boxes. If I now open the first available module, which is the overview, I actually narrowed the list of boxes that you just seen to this particular hybrid project. If I now select the overview of the software development sub box, I will drill down. Okay, let's, let's click one more time. I will drill down to this particular box and I can only see uh, all the uh, all the sub boxes in that case is the iteration. So that's uh, the overview module. It also includes the timeline view and a Kanban board. All you really need to do is just drag and drop the parent box and all the tasks or the schedules are updated as well. When you click the add new button, you will see this dialog with the list of box types that are available. Once your box is created, you can now create the same level box, or you can create a sub box, in which case this is um, this would be the hybrid stage. Now you might be wondering, okay, what happened that when I indent here, the options change here. This can be configured in the big picture administration. So let's have a look at it. What is the box type? It's a configuration template, okay? So the boxes are, in other words, containers, which can be pre-configured using the box types. What is important here is that you can define the parent types. This way, in the dropdown that I showed you a minute ago, now will be narrowed to only those particular parent types. So let me give you an example. I've created my personal box type. If I click the clickable name here, I will be moved to the box type detailed configuration. 